Hello Littles and Jelly Spoons and welcome to the 2017 Christmas hike. Go, 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 go! I turned everything off, yes. Morning chaps. Morning, Matthew. Morning. Are you ready? I'm ready. Are you ready? I'm going to let you yep. go and decide how far we're doing. Okay. 10, 10, 10. <laughs> okay. Which side am I getting in this side? Yeah, Come on, Matthew. 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 Come
fake stone appearances and fooling anybody. More ironic are the deck chairs and seaside merchandise on sale. The only thing missing is some crab lines and inflatable pool chairs. Shocking! Why not just string the path with some multicoloured lights and have done with it? The place has been ruined. I won't be going back and I'm going to make sure that others know how far off the mark the trust is with maintaining this place. Make no mistake, this is a beautiful part of the country and Dovedale is spectacularly beautiful. However, it is because of places like this that I will not be renewing my National Trust membership this year. Will I pay £108 annual joint membership only to visit places like this and to be told by some road man that I have to pay an additional £3 for parking because it's private land. So, despite paying my annual National Trust membership, I have to pay the same amount to visit the site as those who are non-members and have paid nout to the upkeep of this site and others. Three pounds all day? I only wanted an hour. And then, to cap it all, it was 20 pence each to use the toilets. Beautiful stepping stones. Rip off, Carl. They fall in. There we go. Well then, how was that for you? Um, yeah, it was good. Oh, I missed that. <laughs> Come on, Frodo and Bilbo didn't have this much problems. They didn't have to get a map out. They just knew where they were going. Now taking the to God, 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 God. <laughs> That's the problem though. You're the deciding vote. I'm up for 16, Graham's up for 10. <laughs> it's all down to Jono. <laughs> Well, <laughs> 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 I know that forced Graham to do more than he wants to do. Can he manage 16 Graham? It's relatively flat, relatively. I reckon we can. <laughs> unless unless we're going to make a big protest, I reckon can go for it. Ilham, pronounced Ilham, is a village in the Staffordshire Peak District lying on the river Manifold. The population of the civil parish was taken in the 2011 census and came out as about 402. Ilham is best known as the location of the neo-gothic Ilham Hall, a stately home built in the 1820s and now a youth hostel owned by the National Trust. It is set in a large parkland so that are open to visitors. 
Ilum is about four miles from Ashbourne, at the entrance of the scenic Manifold Valley. Ilum is very picturesque, with Swiss chalet-style houses and a matching schoolhouse. It also lies close to the popular Dovedale Valley. Sorry to any Americans who have absolutely no idea what I'm, what or where I'm talking about, and I'm sorry to any Londoners for exactly the same reason. So here we are on, what is it? Beresford Lane. Beresford Lane. Just north of uh, what? South of Hartington. We've come up Dovedale all the way. And now what are we going to do? down into Watton where there's a pub and then a uh, quick break and then follow the river um, <laughs> follow the river something back to the car it's the manifold trail the manifold way <coughs> good. Going. yeah good good <laughs> Graham how's it going yeah all right yeah, good. Yeah. enjoy your table around awesome <laughs> <laughs> Gandalf the Grey. <laughs> Mister, I can get under there, no problem. Yeah. Hey, what are you talking about? Following Graham, aka Gimli. Graham's <laughs> 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 Gimli. <laughs> Who are you and me then? Well, you're Gandalf. I've just said you're Gandalf. Oh, I'm Gandalf. I'm, I'm always Gandalf. So that, that gives me a selection of characters, sort of cross between Legolas and Aragorn, and a bit of a bit of. And yay, we have found the pub. So. Explain to us what's happened there, John. There. Uh, well, for once, we've actually gone exactly the right way. Yeah. We haven't had any details or mistakes. No. So, uh, we've had a few awful moments from John. Eh, where well, yeah, we've put them in just to get these two entertained. Yeah, exactly. I haven't Shouldn't. told them is it's another 20 miles back to the car park. Ah. And we are now going to wetten our whistle. So we could go and kill them. So here we are, having a cheeky sandwich. Hope you don't mind it's pate, Graham. Oh, you're not, I mean, you're not allergic to meat. <laughs> you're not a vegan. I'm not going to argue when you make me a sandwich. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so what's the plan, oh, Big JB? That way. that way. Six miles and we'll be at the car park. We've just got to find that hill. <laughs> And now, as it gets darker, as the sun is setting, and Jono wonders if we're in the right field. See that style? Who said I can't read a map? How's that for a bit of A1 dark navigating? Straight across the field, no hesitation. <laughs> There's one over there as well. Illum Hall, and we can't see the guys because they're down there. I don't know. I could get the, uh, I could get the torchlight out and see if that worked. Let's see. There's a man across the bridge. Anyway. They're in the front of the bridge. And across the field. 
You're confident, John, now? Yeah. Okay, take your word for it. There we are, John. Here we've completed the uh, 2017 Christmas hike. We have. How do you feel? Very, very good. It's been a nice hike. It's been yeah. a very light, nice route. Yeah. Relatively flat, just a bit of a climb at the end. Yeah. But it's, uh, it's been a very nice day. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Very, very good. All in all, good day. As is pretty much compulsory these days, if you like this video, please hit the old like button. Don't don't smash it. There's no need to be aggressive. Come on now. Just a little press will do. If you want to know what crazy antics I'll be getting up to next Wednesday at 6pm British Standard Time, then why not subscribe to find out? And finally, please check me out on other social media platforms. Links are in the description down below. And we shall see you next week. Thanks very much for watching guys and thank you for making it to the end of the video.